The Winchester Mystery House in San Jose, California, is a sprawling Victorian mansion known not only for its architectural oddities but also for its reputed hauntings. Built by Sarah Winchester, the widow of firearm magnate William Winchester, the house was continuously constructed for 38 years until her death in 1922. Legend has it that Sarah was instructed by spirits to keep building to appease the souls claimed by Winchester rifles. Visitors and staff have reported numerous paranormal activities within the mansion's labyrinth and corridors. Unexplained footsteps echo through empty halls, doors open and close on their own, and chilling apparitions of Sarah Winchester herself have been cited. One of the most famous stories involves a medium who, during a seance, claimed to communicate directly with Sarah's spirit, warning her to continue building or face dire consequences. The mansion's architectural quirks, such as staircases that lead to nowhere, doors that open into walls, and windows overlooking other rooms, add to the eerie atmosphere. These strange features are said to be designed to confuse and trap wandering spirits. Paranormal investigators have documented numerous EVP, electronic voice phenomena, recordings and captured ghostly images on camera, reinforcing the mansion's haunted reputation. Today, the Winchester Mystery House is a popular tourist attraction, offering haunted tours that delve into its spooky history and supernatural tales. Whether you're a skeptic or a believer, the house's mysterious aura is undeniably captivating. The Stanley Hotel in Estes Park, Colorado, gained fame not only as the inspiration for Stephen King's The Shining, but also for its own haunted history. Built by Freelan Oscar Stanley, co-founder of the Stanley Motor Carriage Company, the hotel opened in 1909 and quickly became a luxurious getaway in the Rocky Mountains. However, guests and staff have long reported eerie encounters with spirits that linger within its grand halls. One of the most famous ghosts is that of Julia a chambermaid who tragically lost her life in the early 20th century. Julia reportedly haunts the hotel's fourth floor, particularly Suite 217, where she was last seen before her untimely death. Guests staying in this suite have described objects moving on their own, disembodied footsteps, and the sensation of being watched. Some have even claimed to see Julia herself, dressed in period attire, gliding silently through the room. Another prominent apparition is the ghost of a little girl named Flora, who is said to roam the gardens and near the swimming pool. Visitors have reported seeing her playfully chasing after them or disappearing suddenly into thin air. Additionally, the sound of piano music can often be heard emanating from empty rooms, and the elevator has been known to open and close without anyone inside. The Stanley Hotel embraces its haunted legacy, offering ghost tours and paranormal investigations that attract enthusiasts from around the world. Whether you're staying overnight or simply exploring its storied corridors, the hotel's supernatural presence is an integral part of its charm and mystique. The RMS Queen Mary, now permanently docked in Long Beach, California, serves as both a historic hotel and a hotspot for paranormal activity. Among the many ghost stories associated with the ship, the most famous is that of Room B340 in the Queen Mary Hotel. Room B340 is notorious for its spectral resident, often referred to as the Lady in Black. This apparition is believed to be the spirit of a woman who tragically died in the room though the exact details of her demise remain shrouded in mystery. Guests staying in B340 have reported a range of unsettling experiences, including sudden drops in temperature, flickering lights, and the feeling of an invisible presence watching them. One of the most compelling encounters involves the appearance of the lady in black herself. Visitors have described seeing her elegant figure standing silently by the window or floating gracefully across the room. Some have even captured photos of her ethereal form, although skeptics argue that these images could be optical illusions or camera artifacts. In addition to the Lady in Black, Room B340 is said to house other spirits, including a little girl who laughs and plays with invisible toys and a sailor who repeats his final moments aboard the ship. Paranormal investigators have conducted numerous sessions in the room, recording unexplained noises, EVPs, and shadowy movements that further fuel the ship's haunted reputation.
Staying in room B340 is considered a must for ghost hunters and thrill seekers visiting the Queen Mary. Whether the hauntings are genuine or products of vivid imaginations, the room's eerie atmosphere leaves a lasting impression on all who enter.